What's up, y'all? So, I'm back again. <laughs> so, I just came home. I I just, I had to go out to the liquor store because, as y'all know, tomorrow is <clears throat> my grandson's christening. So, I had to go out and get some champagne or what, what have you. So, everybody fell in love with the Moscato that I had bought for my daughter's uh, baby shower that she had seven months back. So I just bought some more of that blue, blue Moscato. This is, when I tell you this is good, this is good. But I only felt like, I only bought, I bought like, I bought five bottles. But honestly, I don't even think we need that much because I'm not gonna take the other ones out. I don't think we need that much because it's not gonna be that many people there. My daughter chose not to have too many people there because she said it's just a little something, something, a little christening with the godparents, the grandparents, and one or two other people that she wanted to be there. She said it didn't make sense to have a big old skeptical or whatever. You know, she didn't want it to be like a party. She just wanted a couple of people to gather up for the christening and we just have a little brunch afterwards and then you know everybody go home or whatever. So that's it. But anyway, I think five bottles is good. Cause I think it's gonna be maybe about twelve people all together. So five bottles of Moscato should be good. Cause mostly everybody don't drink and it's not it's not gonna be like a a thing where we're gonna have hard liquor or nothing like that. It's just like some mimosas and stuff like that. So they can either drink it plain, because it's good plain, and it's nice color blue. Or they can mix it with um, some orange juice and have some mimosas. But either way, I think five is five is good because it's only gonna be about twelve of us. So five bottles. Ain't nobody trying to go home drunk or nothing like that. So and then my sister probably have some Moscato also because she keeps Moscato at her house. So basically we're going to go to the christening and then after that we're going to go to my sister house for the brunch and I'm going to video all of that so y'all can see what goes on and this, that, and that. So I just wanted to show y'all what I got from the liquor store for the christening. So I'm going to go in the room. It is so nice outside y'all. It's so nice outside. I don't understand. Our summer was crap. And now here we is. Oh, here we are, excuse me. Almost in November, like a couple of weeks away from November. And tomorrow here in New York, it's going to be 79 degrees. You might as well say 80 degrees. And then Sunday, it's going to rain and it's only going to be 50 something degrees. This weather is crazy. But anyway, I'm going to go. I got me some food in the room. I'm going to sit down. I'm going to eat. I'm going to chill. I'm going to get my stuff ready for tomorrow. The christening starts at 10 o'clock tomorrow morning. So I have to get out what I'm going to wear. And, oh, and I got to make some parfaits for the christening. So after I eat, I'm going to make the parfaits. And then I'm going to go lay down, rest, rest up, and get ready for tomorrow. So... I'm going to talk to y'all later. I got to go. I got things to do, food to eat, rest to take, and I'll talk to y'all later. Peace.